But my guru when it comes to, you know, the, the Witcher universe is Therica. So, and literally this is true. Whenever I'd be like, oh my God, I don't understand. Why, why is Tosea doing that? I'd call up Therica and be like, Therica, why, um, why is Tosea doing this? And Therica would sort of give me, send me like a sort of thesis about why, <laughs> and, you know, all the background. So I'm very, very grateful to this woman right here because she has, she has saved me. Hi, how are you doing? Doing great. Thank you so much for sharing time with us in We Podcast. My name is Shabazz. Hello, Hi, Shabazz. Shabazz. And you, you are? my name right. Anthony. 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 Anthony and Shabazz. What a treat. Hit us with your questions, guys. Yeah, guys, <laughs> us. We're ready. We're, we're going to be as spoiler-free as possible as well. All right, beautiful. Okay. Now, Mayana, you play both characters spectacularly, but how does your experience playing Tshaya compare with voice acting Anna in The Witcher 3 game? Um, they're completely different, you know, and I was sort of saying, you know, when it's wonderful when you see how stories that are taken from the same source material can um, come out into the world so incredibly differently. Um, so for me, it's almost like entirely different jobs and obviously entirely different characters. Um, and it's just an honor and great fun mm -hmm. to be able to have played in, in both of those universes. Really wonderful. Absolutely. And was there one that you enjoyed doing more than the other? Oh, that's not fair. I don't want to like, I don't want to, okay, I don't want to be down on the game, but I have to say playing Tesea, which I've now done, you know, it's been about five years of my life um, involved in this, the, these three seasons mm -hmm. and so far and they've been incredible years. I've really, really loved it. And I've got to spend more time with Tosei, I suppose, and more time with the TV series. So I suppose if I have to choose, I, I would choose um, Tosei in the TV series. But um, that's no shade on on the games at all. I love the games. Yeah, the I'm game's great. Fan. Yeah, big fan of the games. Yeah, Therica here is a gamer, so she like plays them all the time. It's great. Do you yeah. play them and listen to me? I do play them this and do. Oh, there I we didn't go. realize it was you, though. Oh, you see? Yeah, there we go. It. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Yes, no carry worries. on. No <laughs> uh, worries. what can we expect from Sabrina this season? I know there's Ooh. always a rivalry between you and Yennefer, so. Oh, you're definitely going to see a lot more of that. She's more confident. She's more provocative. She's more sexy. Um, she's more feisty. And you also see her at one point break a bit. You see her in like life-threatening situations. You see her, you see the consequences of those situations. And you see just, you see her vulnerable side, but it's in juxtaposition to having that fiery side. So you've got a bit of everything with Sabrina this season. Yes. It's very fun. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Is there an episode this season that you're most excited for fans to see? And Mayana, we can start with you. Should we do it at the same time? Yeah, yeah. ready? Wait, are you just going to say the number? Should we just say the number of the episode? You well? say the number. Okay. okay. Three, two, one, five. five. Oh, okay. <laughs> we've been hearing a lot of five and six and seven as kind of like the, the runners that are that are most important. Yeah. So far. Now, listen, don't get us wrong. Like all of the episodes are wonderful to, oh, for yes. us to shoot. And also we have, you know, we get the privilege on a show like this. We have four different directors that come in who are fantastic, all really, really different. It's been really cool for us. We've had our first two female directors, mm. which has been really major for us. Um, um, and uh, and you can just tell there's a difference on set for sure when, when, uh, when there's a little bit more equality between like um uh, crew and um uh, and set and producers and everything you you can just taste it on set when you walk on but i think you'll understand when you watch episode five or fans will understand why it's been so meaningful t for us um uh, it, it was it was one of those it was a delight for the eye as soon as you stepped yeah. onto set it was an incredible experience because um a lot of us got to be together for the first time and spend a lot of time together in it. It was really meaningful for us. Cavill's no doubt the biggest Witcher fan out there. Was there ever a time where he's testing you on the lore of the Witcher? Maybe during your days off? Every single day. And it was really hard. <laughs> and you know what? I just couldn't live up to his high expectations. And it would, no, no, never. He would yeah, never he do that. that. He had such a gentleman. Yeah, he'd he's be really supportive. And if you had any questions, like he'd be really happy to offer up yeah. help, but he would never push it on no, you. No, no, no. That's not sort of how he rolls. He's he's just, yeah, like no, you say. He's so he's kind. A gent. He's so welcome. Just such a gentleman on and off set. Mm. Absolutely. But my guru when it comes to, you know, the, the Witcher universe is Therica. So, and literally this is true. Whenever I'd be like, 
oh my god, I don't understand. Why why is Tessaia doing that? I'd call up Therica and be like, Therica, why um why is Tessaia doing this? And the Therica would sort of give me send me like a sort of thesis about why, <laughs> and, you know, all the background. So I'm very, very grateful to this woman right here because she has she has saved me throughout, <laughs> you know, throughout all of these seasons and, and helped me sort of if if I've done anything good with Tessaia, it's a lot of it is down to this one here. So oh. yeah. I mean, she's been very sweet. kind, very it's kind. Very, it's very yeah. true. It's just, it's truth, fact. You have such an amazing bond and such amazing chemistry, and we can't wait for the fans to watch it as well when this season comes out. Thank you so much for your time with us today, and uh, have a great rest of your day. Thank you oh, so much, guys. You, so you much. too. Much love. Honestly, thank such you. such a pleasure. Thank you for interviewing us.